Final blue what? No, not yet. No? Fingers crossed. Knock on the wood. It hadn't happened yet. Oh, God. Oh, my gosh. See what 26 PSI does? We're on the racetrack. Oh, bro. <laughs> the whole bridge is gone. Oh, my. The whole bridge fell over. Oh, no. Well, I have a lot of work to do now. Well, Poor like grandma. Tornado alley in the trunk. It Realistic. Happens. Yep. Track's done for. See? Oklahoma. Bad tornadoes. Outside your trunk, inside your trunk. Happens all the time. <laughs> like, well, we were going to say it's getting bagged. But... Oh, yeah. Yeah, hold on. I go get that. Okay, y'all ever see that movie called Robots? Talk about the blue guy. The blue the... guy. He kept getting handy down parts. That's how I feel right now. I got handy downs. Hand me downs from your cousin, Jeffrey. But it worked, supposedly. Those aren't handy downs. Yes, this is exactly. Hey, look, it's even chrome. So are they on a uh, yeah, rice and ice? <laughs> yeah, nice to rice, rice and ice. First things first, we got a back fruit loop. Here's more or less all the parts to do so. We're not using this tank, we have another tank. I see, so it's not all old parts. Yeah, we have we have a mixture. It's a good mix. The only thing pre-owned is the bags. Yes. Yeah, we have new management, new controller, new tank, dual 480, chrome um, compressors. Cool. This is bagging a 335i on a budget. Perks of being employed at Speedo. Okay. Matt found a really good deal on some uh, struts and uh, picked them up for us. So now we actually have struts for the car. Forced me to. This was like another year down the road. Not like, okay, now we're bagging your car. So thanks, Matt. Yeah. Can't believe it. Pretty good right there. Don't move. It's already drilling. That didn't take long. Okay, so the tank is in. Um, be a good stopping point for right now. The next step would be to rough mount the compressors, figure out if we want them straight or at an angle behind the tank. We don't know yet. Um, so yeah, that'd be it. So we're starting on the struts. Correct. So we're going to start um, loosening up some suspension and start. This strut's a little worn. It's always obviously leaking a little bit, but the other three are good. So like, you know, three out of four is pretty solid change some fittings out on the bags and start putting them back in. Okay, we've got everything together. We're gonna see what it looks like with the uh, tire on for the first time. So, we're gonna put the other side on and drop it down. It's crazy, it's like stock right height. She's low. Lift arm's released. So this is fully aired out all the way down. Yep. Look at the rear. <laughs> the rear went farther back. Down all the way in. Yeah. She tucks hard. Tuck the rear. Okay, so we're mounting the compressors right now, and we're thinking we're gonna go with this like diagonal look. We were contemplating like putting them straight on either side, but I think this is the final. Does that make sense? Yeah. So you're perfectly squared like here, right? Yeah. So if we can just get the other side exactly square, so we're just and then you're there, yeah, you're square perfectly. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're running uh, lines. Yes, yeah, so we're running the last line, and somehow it's taken us all night to do this. Yep. Um, so, yeah, it's 1.30 right now currently. Matt's car, you'll see in another video, is 
being put together also at 1.30. Um, so this is our last line. We have done all of the like, actual wiring. All the wiring is 95% of the way done. I have some more to run to the front of the car. Um, everything in the back's done. Compressors are up, management's in. Um, so this is our last line. We're gonna hook it in the management, tuck all the um, hoses, and then hopefully within the next hour, about 2.30, we'll be done. <laughs> Oh, I just remembered you did something custom for yours. Oh yeah, tank strapped. We matched it to the car. It's well, supposed yeah. to be a surprise. To who? Who are we surprising? Oh yeah, y'all. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it is a surprise. They haven't seen it yet. It's not true. Technically in the car. It was in the car. We pulled it back out of the car. <laughs> and then we had our, our buddy leave his house, come back and wrap it for us. Yeah, shout out to Landon and Simply Auto Styling. Shout out to Simple. Yep. Holy cow. Now I have to remember which line is which. We ran all these lines up here and we didn't plug them in as we ran them. So mm -hmm. now I don't know which line goes to which hole. Dang, it's on. Okay, it is now 5.30 and the car's done. Yay. Next, next day. And the 335i is finished and on bags. Yes, sir. So last week we finished the car. Um, kind of last second obviously. We finished it Thursday, we packed up and we left for the Euro Rally. And now it's the week after we are back. The car made it all the way there and all the way back. Didn't have a single leak. And now we're here, and so I'm gonna show it off. Yep, so trunk setup is done. You wanna pop the trunk? Yeah, I'll pop the trunk. That is sick. Finished product. Finished product. We definitely rushed how we did the trunk setup. We used brass fittings, we couldn't get any, um, Silver fittings, I should say. Couldn't get them in time. We did all soft lines, DOT line. We just ran out of time to do any like proper hard line setup. You know, obviously we started on the Monday and we finished it Thursday morning. So we ran out of time, but for right now it works. Car sits low. Car looks really good. I'm really happy. It's crazy too, because I don't know if I've actually ever seen like a car on a tire with bags. Yeah, so we're tucking a 275 40. So we're tucking the entire wheel, tire plus part of the wheel. This is wild. Yep, that's it. Newest uh, Fruit Loop mod. There you go. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, subscribe, comment. We'll see you later.